hey guys welcome back to my youtube channel i am my renee for those who do not know me yet and welcome all right so today i'm gonna be doing yet another fashion try on haul because i have the shopping addiction it's not as bad as other addictions so i'm not gonna stop it Yes, I might go broke doing it, but at least I'll be cute and broke. <laughs> um, so basically I brought like zero shirts to college with me and I brought like every single pair of pants and almost all my shoes. And I just didn't think to bring any shirts. So I bought a lot and I have two pair of pants to show y'all, but I have a lot of shirts. That's what we're here for. I'm just thinking about how bad my hair is going to look when this video is over because I keep having to put shirts over my hair like it's going to look so bad like they're going to be all loopy and stuff like floppy and like flat but I guess it's the price I'm willing to pay all right but without further ado don't forget to like subscribe share comment all of it let's get into the video all right so this is the first shirt i got it says positive days and it's just a really oversized tee and at the bottom it says look for the good in each day when i saw positive days i was thinking mm, good days by sizzle vibes it doesn't really give that vibe but i'm gonna pretend it does um, I got it from H&M. It was on sale for like $17. What? It was $19. What the fuck? But you know what? $2. Let's make it count. <laughs> so I got these pants from Walmart and I bleached them myself. They're very much big. They were. They weren't this big when I got them. And somehow they got really big. But this is them. I put some holes in them. Ow, ow, ow. Uh. But yeah, pants. On to the next item. This is the second shirt I got. It's really a t-shirt dress. But like, it doesn't look good as a t-shirt dress. So I like to pull up and make it a shirt let me get y'all a better view like it's like a dress but i just pull it up to my waist and boom it's a shirt now because it looks better as a shirt than a t-shirt dress i was thinking about just cutting it so i don't have to keep doing this because it also looks weird i don't know but i got this from h&m too it was also really expensive I don't know why I keep spending money there. It's really expensive for no reason. Anyways, moving on. Okay, so I'm not putting this shirt on because I know for a fact I'm not gonna be able to get my hair through it. Y'all see how small the hole is, right? Yeah. It's just this shirt. I got it from a thrift store, of course, because I'm a low-key thrift queen, thrift store queen, but whatever. This is the shirt, it's a little crop top. I was thinking about wearing it at a party. A little party shirt. I don't know if y'all realize by now, but I really have a thing for oversized t-shirts. I don't know why. Why am I holding this? All right, so I got this shirt from Shane. I'm pretty sure the wording is like off. It's from Shane, what, what? What am I about to expect there? Anyways, it just says Chicago, and I only got this shirt because it's gonna match these pants I got. Um, because I'm hoping it'll match these pants because it's like rainbow. If not, I'm really gonna cry because, yeah, this is the first shirt. It's really nothing to it. It was cheap, it was on sale. Okay, so next I got this shirt because I really want to incorporate color into my wardrobe because as it is, I really only wear, oh, this is on right, hold on. Okay, yeah, it's on right. 
because I really only ever wear black or black and that's it. So I got this shirt. Only reason why I got it is because I thought I would match these shoes, but they're literally different oranges. Like, but anyways, I thought it was cute. If the back says, bring good luck. I just thought it was such a cute little shirt. You know, I really like flowers. But yeah, I don't know. It's really a weird material. Like, I don't know how to explain it. It's just weird. And on to the next item. Oh wait, it don't even match the purse. It'll probably match my yellow tail far bag that I ordered to my house back in Pittsburgh and not to Philadelphia. <sighs> Whatever. Okay, so this is one of those shirts that I've seen on Sheen like every time I go on and I'm like, mm, maybe I'll get it next time. Maybe I'll get it next time. Y'all, I finally decided to just get it because why not? I was already in a mood to spend money. So I decided let's spend money. And on the back, it says baby girl some more, it has butterflies. Yeah, it's just a white shirt. Y'all, this is the most like t-shirt, like material shirt that Shane has ever given me. Like, this is what like all regular t-shirts feel like. And I finally got it because they be giving me like that really stretchy, like weird material. This is not that. This is that t-shirt material. Eh, try again. So this is that t-shirt quality material. A1, crisp, period. Uh -huh. Where's my clicker? This is another shirt I got. I forgot what painting like the hints are from. Like I used to know because I learned about it in a history class, but that was back in high school and high school is really a blur right now. But I got this shirt. It's kind of cute. I know a lot. I know I have my cousin. She got this tattooed on her knee, like just but yeah, and like they added two butterflies. Yeah, this is it up close so you can see the detail. Okay, so I don't even know what number shirt I'm on. I was gonna start counting them, but then I forgot. Um, shirt number 66. It just says, don't say much. I don't know what compelled me to get this, but I got it. I'm not mad at it actually. Like, it's cool because like the letters protrude. They're not like iron on, well, I don't know what it is actually. Like I'm pretty sure it's iron on, but like it protrudes. Yeah. Um, so this shirt came in a totally different bag. It like came in this bag. And I'm like, did it come from some other brand? Because the thing says like new wave street culture. And it says it on the tag too. And like usually sheen tags don't like say all of this. So I'm just like, does this come from some brand or something? I don't know. I'm not mad at it. Also, this is definitely a t-shirt. Like, I swear if Sheen did not make this because this is so t-shirty. This ain't Sheen material. This is not Sheen quality. This is it's a step above. I actually kind of like it. I didn't even like it when I bought it, but I kind of like it now that I have it. You know, sometimes that just happens. Okay, real quick before uh, works. 
Well, first, before I get into the shirt I'm wearing, I got this. It's like a long sleeve shirt. I got it because I really like the sleeves of it and the words on it and stuff. Um, I couldn't put it on because this does not stretch at all. I couldn't get it over my knots. I tried and they started coming out. So I was like, just gonna hold it up. Here's the shirt. And here's the shirt I'm wearing. It just has a whole lot of butterflies on it. I need to stop getting shirts with butterflies on it because I think I have like five now. Butterfly boy. You know, speaking of butterflies, has anybody watched Nevertheless? <laughs> such a good show. It's on Netflix. It is really such a good show. That's all. Public service announcement over. We have some more soldiers that didn't make it over my head. <laughs> Anyways, so I think this is part of like, I think this shirt is one of the things that like, I think they had like designers come and make a shirt. I don't know, the tag says Daisy and so did the bag. Like it didn't even say she on it, it said Daisy. But got this shirt. Now I'm wondering, is that flower a Daisy? What are daisies? Ignore. It's just this shirt, plain and simple. I just thought it was really creative and nice. Um, this is part of the Sheen X like little thing and it's this shirt. I really like it because like, I don't know. It just spoke to me. Cause I know I've always seen like pictures of this like when I was like in middle school and I used to make them like my little Facebook profile picture or whatever. And then like, look, it's on my shirt now. And I just thought it was cute in the flowers, you know, I really love me some sunflowers and roses. My two favorite flowers and they're literally on the shirt. So I bought it. It was expensive and I, I don't know why I bought it. Uh, I think the Sheen X is also made by like designers that come from outside of Sheen. I could be wrong. Like, I feel like I think that's what it is. And I think that long sleeve shirt that I couldn't put over my head was part of it too. And the shirt that said Daisy. And the shirt that said, don't talk, don't speak much, don't talk much. What did it say? Don't talk much? I don't know. But I think those are all part of like designers that like gave her designs to Sheen and Sheen recreated them. Don't know, I think. Mm. Right, and then I have stomping. Anyways, I have the All right, I have this shirt. It's just some hearts on fire. I thought it was cute. And y'all know I love black clothing. So here, but no, I'm scared that these aren't gonna last long. Like, I feel like if I put them in the washer, they're definitely gonna fall off. But I really hope not, cause it's really cute. It's such a cute shirt. Like, I feel like the most wears I'll get out of this if they start falling off is like five, if even five. And it's that weird, like really stretchy, like material. I don't know if y'all can like, I don't know if y'all can like see it, but it's like that weird material because Sheen loves that material for some reason. I don't know why, but they do. And they keep using it. And I never asked for it. Neither did any of us, but whatever. It stretches. Next clothing. Y'all, so I was looking at one of my bags and it's like oh dirt God. on it. I thought it was mold, but I think it's dirt. It's still ill. So I got these cargo pants from the thrift store. 
I wish they were baggier, like where my thighs were, are, but they're like tight on my thighs and then they're like loose at the bottom. But I wish they were loose all the way around, but whatever. I'm still gonna wear them because they're still kind of cute. And then I got this little alien shirt thing. So I'm pretty sure I ordered it in like a gray material, but it came in a brown like color and I'm just like, what? It's still cute, but like I would have rather like that that gray material, you know, or probably would look so much better. But I think this is the last item, so yeah. This is a shirt that I ordered and I'm waiting for. This is the end of yet another one of my hauls. If you want me to do more hauls, which I'm probably still gonna do anyways. Like, show this video some love, put some comments in the comment section, and until next time. When the sky is blue and my pink for a and my boys